humans right, have got no place in Rockalong. We've got an echoing voice. All right. Okay. Wow, brick. Oh, are you serious, sir? What the hell was that? How do I... I have three bricks I can draw into, and I draw every single one of them. How does that happen? Oh, what are you doing to me, man? That sucks. Alright. Start off not with safe the, uh, Vryhead Vanguard here. Not even a very good Vryhead Vanguard. Really? So he's playing like pure reveal. Well, maybe. I guess it could still be a Shoop deck. He plays right into Garrett Professional here, and we probably take it. We're not likely to get an incredibly great Garrett Pro against uh, Morphin, no matter what variant he's running. I mean, if he shows up with Tibor, then obviously that's better. But we don't know whether or not he's playing Tibor. We don't expect him to be playing Tibor. We don't have uh, our lock. It's not row lock. Yeah, let's just take the Geralt here. Let's get this over. Get Roach out of the deck as well. One less brick for us to deal with. <clears throat> Your attention, please. I How about shall you just now find speak. the last Witcher and just really punish me? Oh, I don't care about that card. I don't even want that card. That card gets locked every single time. Man, my hand sucks. I gotta be honest, my hand really sucks. You can play... can play one Dragoon. Do we want... well... We don't really even want to have these cards Onward, in the hand in the late game. It can counter something like Isbel. But we don't necessarily... We're, we're not necessarily keeping that in round three. Time to get our hands dirty. Okay. Is he playing a mill deck? Is that what's going on here? He's doing a nice job of thinning out all my shitty four provision cards. So I appreciate that at least. Play, we'll play one more of these guys. Slaughter them to a man! And if he doesn't remove any of our elves, next turn we'll play the Scoyatel Neophyte. Put two elves on the board. And summon the Aileron from our deck. Huh. Treason. That's an interesting card to play. Zarthisius. So he's playing something silly here. He's not playing any sort of meta deck. None shall tread on us! And we will boost. We shall drive the ape men into the sea. Ellerin comes out. And if he doesn't remove it, we can get a free call of the forest here. Beast or man, it's no difference to me. He doesn't remove it. Okay. So what are we going to pull from our deck here? We don't need our lock right now. We don't really need Ida. Yaven does six damage. It's five damage. I think we're probably just going to play Isengrim. That's got to be the best thing we can do right here. Spale! 
There we go. Humans to the sea! And we are way ahead right now. So it's looking pretty good. Probably going to force a pass with this play. Yep. So we don't really know what he's playing. Um, I'm gonna just keep this hand, I think. He's shown us a couple of mill cards. Could be a mill deck. I don't even know how mill decks operate right now, to be honest. Yeah, he's definitely some kind of mill deck. But, like, mill decks are bad, right? <laughs> like, they're kind of terrible. So, we just play a long round three and just beat him. God. Go away, witchers. Torch, yes. Alright, we're not super worried about that. So, our leadoff play is either going to be Vanguard or Swordmaster. Swordmaster is probably going to get locked, but we want to take the extra point on Vanguard, I think. I was hoping you would say that. Sure, no problem. Wow. Okay. He's going to get scorched really hard. I can remove his Magni Division with my lane. But, like, why do that? I'm just gonna, like, scorch the hell out of it when the time comes. But we'll just play the Swordmaster sword for now. It's gonna get answered. He's got Alba Armored Calvary or Ox. Oh, yes. Okay. Another unit that's going to grow. I can just kill it though. I don't need to let it survive. They can hide when there is no escape. Wise choice. Yeah, he's playing like pure reveal. I don't think he can mess with my deck at all. At, at this point. He's already played Treyhern and two Viper Witchers. What I'm going to do is... Just take this ping right now. Boost. The time of the white frost and white light is now. Boost my sword master. Let's see if maybe that helps it survive for another turn. He doesn't seem to have to stars reflected in a pond for the Villa forts. Okay, I guess I should have seen that coming. Whatever. Do I take the Scorch or do I get greedy? Like, surely I get greedy. I have so many pings available to me. It would be silly to take a Scorch right now. Alright, we'll just play the last two Witchers. Whatever. Shit. <laughs> Sorry, bud. Um, hmm. 
So I don't want to disalign my Scorch here. I think we just take Teruvial and We can like kill the Vilga Forts, for example. Sure. That's fine. It looks like I'm probably going to take the Yaven here. We were lots to run us to start this war. It seems reasonable to me. To the front yet again. Yeah, we're gonna run away with this one. Alright, we're concerned about something like an Isbel or an Ockfist or something. We're going to take uh, Melane. Yes, do one. Just ping some stuff here. Golem, huh? Alright. Interesting. So do I just take the Scorch now? Probably. Unless his last card is Tibor. His last card probably is Tibor, right? So what do I want to lock here? Maybe I want to lock the Eskel. Lock it at 13. Yeah, it seems fine. If he plays Tibor, he is going to get just murdered. He's going to get murdered anyway, it doesn't matter. He can't play around this Scorch, I have all four of my pings. You should not have come. Against me. Valeria and Rivia! For the North! I feel like we're pretty favored in this matchup. We've got a lot of control to shut down those engines. Manage not to drop any bricks this time, that's good. Red coin, that's very good. All of these good communication. So I can remove remove that with the Melane. I'm not sure that I really want to. I mean, I don't care if he gets some pings on me. He doesn't have anything like a scorch or anything that punishes me for him aligning my units. I'm also not playing any engines. You can set up Kedwini Revenant with it. That's not so bad. It's not the end of the world. Right, we're gonna play in the melee road. Death yeah, to okay. humans! Really? Wyvern scale shield. 
have Ida in hand. Probably want to just spend it now. To be fair. Why have you summoned me? There we go. He's in a big hole now. Down eight points. I'm about to hit him with Witchers. He just. I, I just traded up on him so hard. You know, I play. He plays one, I play seven. So that's really good for us. So that I might want to kill. How many more answers do I have in my deck? Here in these can answer some of his ranged or his um, his row locked units. Yaven can answer something. I don't know. I feel like that's gonna be a big pain in my ass if I let Follow him. me this way. I want to keep the pressure on here. This will be quick and painful. All right, I've got those two. On the con on the on the other hand, I can also try to get my Elrin out, but I'm always going to get my Elrin out. He, he doesn't have enough removal to prevent me from that. So yeah, I like Witcher's here. Get the work. Too old for this shit. Necromancy. To arms! Hmm. So, this is probably the best Geralt Professional I'm going to get in this game. Um, I might be able to get a 6-point Avalok later, but we've got some other answers to Avalok. So, I think this is fine. Not your lucky day. I think I'm going to push this round. To be honest, this dies to Vess. Okay. So, I won the first round on even, right? So I can push for free. Question is, do I want to? I have some answers to his round three engines. I probably want to break up his Hubert combo if he's playing Hubert. Feels weird to push here, but I mean, I'm on even. No, I've always been a proponent of pushing. Your tricks will not save you, Dwar. When you're on even here. Huh. Any last one? Try to get Ellerin out this round. Might not be able to. Nothing else, I want to break up some of his stuff. I, I really do feel like I can probably get a card.
If I can kill that with a uh, Yaven or Archer plus a leader ping. Do I want to do that? I think so. I think we'll be we can spend one leader ping here. Or or we can just leave it, to be honest. Yeah, I think I like that better. We have lost the ones to start this war. Oh, okay. Yevon doesn't count himself. I didn't realize that. That's fine. Appearances casting this. Okay, there's the avatar. Peace with humans? I buy thus! Wow, Vernon Roach comes down. Okay. That's a pretty good card to get out of him. Starting to think that maybe we will go ahead and kill the uh, Lyrian Arbalist with a leader pen. Didn't spend one. It's one ping that basically winds up being worth three points. All right, don't remove any of my elves, bro. Take a 12 point scorch now. I can also not. Alright, here's what we're gonna do. What has he got left in his deck? I think we get a better scorch than this. I'm gonna play Ice and Grimmer. The only good human is a dead human. That also might have been incorrect. Not quite as experienced with this back. That seems pretty good. See ya! 